Hey guys, welcome back. I hope you're well, and let's continue with Laravel Valley. Now let's do a valley list, and we're gonna secure some of those sites, okay? So we're gonna use the help command as well. So we're gonna say valet, and we're gonna type in help, and we're gonna type in secure. So what that will do is it just kind of gives us a definition of how you do this, and secure gives your domain, your TLD, a trusted TLS certificate. So you can set the amount of days. I think the default is 368, but we can say, use this flag expired in. So let's say we wanted to be within a direction. We say valet and we're going to secure. Actually, just before we do that, let me just show you what an unsecured site looks like. So it says not secure. So we, we can kind of see this. This is local. And if you wanted to test out some functionality using HTTPS, um, whether you're building an API or you just wanted to see something that's, that's behind like a secure certificate, um, locally, you can check this out. Okay, so we know right now that this is not secure. So we'll just keep that in mind. And we'll jump down to Valley again and we'll try to secure this now. And we will secure uh, my app. And here we go. It's gonna ask you for some credentials and stuff like that. And then it'll run this. So it'll restart Nginx and it will secure this particular site with our TLD with a TLS certificate. So we'll go back to our site and we'll refresh. And you'll see now that it has a lock and it's HTTPS, okay? To reverse this or to you know unsecure this, it's basically the same process, but we'll say unsecure. It'll restart once more and it will unsecure that site. We'll go back, we'll refresh. Okay, and here we are back again at my app. And as you can see, it's unsecure. It's no longer secured. What you can do with that flag that we took a look at uh, under the help file, you can do the same thing and say valet and you can secure it. And maybe you only need my app to be secured for, I don't know, a certain amount of time. So you would type in expire in and then how long we'll say like a day, you know, so it'll do the same thing and then it'll restart. And we know that in literally a day from now, this thing will no longer have this certificate. So it will no longer be valid. And let's just use valet to open this up. And we're back to secure. And I'm not gonna wait a day, but take my word for it. <laughs> it will revert back to being unsecure. And let's do a valet list. So just quickly going over some of the commands that we've already done. We've done help, okay, we've done install we've checked out um open we've also checked restart secure uh secured uh we haven't checked that one out and then unsecure so basically what secure does is if you say valet secured type that in it just tells you the sites that are secured and in this case it's just the one we're gonna skip share we did start we did stop we did tld we did trust we did uninstall and we did unlink and unsecure and that's it for this one guys i will see you later take care so don't forget to like subscribe let me know your thoughts below hit the notification bell i will see you guys in the next one take care until next time